okay because I'm potentially about to get a bit soggy down here uh, because I know it's coming up let's just do a quick change that's better that's more me Okay, so I'll show you the path after all. Head back down to the river in a minute. Um, this is the route through Causeway Wood. Bottom side of the wood, anyway. That's where we just were down there. Okay, so we've just come back down that path there. It's got a nice little feature just there. I'm not sure if there's been some building been knocked down there before. Uh, the bridge carries on through all masses of garlic, and then we're down to the river. Okay, so it looks like we've had a few trees down, probably from the beginning of the year when the storms hit, which is a bit of a shame. We'll go a bit further that way in a minute. Uh, there's a big tunnel there that leads to a waterfall. However, there is also, just here, Another little tunnel. So this one reminds me a little bit of Horsewood Tunnel, which we've covered before. Um, okay. A good explorer always comes prepared. Can't see the end with my torch. Um, so we're gonna have to head in, see what we can find. Here we go. Okay, so this is a fairly good tunnel, solid, well made, bigger than it looks as well, even though I'm only hobbit sized of course. Uh, it does go in quite a way, let's see how far it goes. So there's water flowing through it. If you can see, it gets lower here and then into a pipe at the end. So I think there's not much point going any further. Uh, not sure where the pipe comes out, but anyway, we are quite a long way in here. That's cool. Okay, so I'm heading back out. So as always, same rule applies if you ever go anywhere like this. Um, safety first, don't do anything reckless. Take a torch, let people know where you are. That's what I do. <laughs> I just make it look a bit more dangerous than it actually is. Uh, so please be careful. Right, let's continue our explore. <laughs> 